Bulls still have not connected for a field goal. Alston, top of the circle, looks back door, bounces to the Mulkey right baseline. Out long to Barnett, left corner fills, and he'll try a three. It's good. Good ball reversal, good patience, and ball reversal for the shot. Four, four tie. Could be big for Filson to knock down that first trifecta. Both teams have subbed in some guys for the Bulls. Gerard Oldham is now in to replace Zach Filson. Only five seconds on the shot clock here. Mulkey looking inbound, bouncing to Barnett, cutting in from the left, and he finger rolls it in to score. It's a 6 6 tie. Right wing, it comes to Abreu, low right McKnight. He backs into the mid lane on Alston, now spins to the baseline, loses control of the ball going up. The rebound out long, poked by Mulkey into the backcourt. He recovers and goes in for the wide open layup. Good defense by the Bulls, alert defense. It is 8 to 8, seven minutes into the game. Oldham will inbound for UB, bounces under the hoop for Rayleigh Ross. Kicks it back to Oldham in the right corner. Right elbow McCray bounces it to Alston under the basket who lays Whoa. it in. Javon McCray has such a feel for the game to see those passing lanes. A first, great passer. First Bulls lead at 10 to 8. Boy, that was a great pass. Bulls with three freshmen in there now. Oldham, Rayleigh Ross, and New Arianc. Watt and Robinson also on the floor for UB. Robinson top of the circle, dribbles to the right wing, now turns the corner toward the basket, takes it all the way to the rim, lays it home, and draws a foul. Nice move by Titus Robinson, putting UB back in front 12 to 11, and now he goes to the line. He's in the Buffalo board. UB needs a hoop, it's 21-13 Akron. Mulkey right baseline, Barnett open for an 18-footer, it's good. There you go. Barnett. Barnett's finally got effective. somebody open, and they uh, can the shot when you get open, but uh, Akron has been real stingy on uh, giving open looks to the basket. Nine-point lead for Akron, and it stays at nine as a free throw misses. Rebound off the hands of McCray, but taken off the deck by Alston, and it is UB ball. Bulls have been out-rebounded today. That's not going to make the coaches happy so far. High on the right side, Alston, cross-court to McCray, left wing. Now left corner, Barnett. Dave wants to take to the basket, does, puts it off the backboard, no good. McRae, though, rebounds, left-handed, back up and in. First two for McRae. they got to find a way to get the ball to him in their half-court sets. 43rd block shot this year for Marshall. Mulkey inbounds left of the lane, McRae, left corner, Mulkey. He'll try a three from there, it's there good. Go. Mulkey. An assist for McRae, he saw Mulkey step it inbounds, got it to him. 29-25, Akron. Akron has led the majority of the half. Been four ties, four lead changes. McCray buzzes a backdoor bounce pass to Barnett, and he lays it in. McCray just threaded the needle with that wow. pass. He, he sure did. Between He threw it past two defenders. It's off the glass, no good. It's rebounded by Oldham. Bulls with enough time to get a shot. Mulkey front court right. Needs to shoot. Launches it from 25. He hit it. Got it. He hit it. Great way to finish the half. Mulkey brings the Bulls within two at halftime. <laughs> Byron Mulkey drained it from between the circles, and it's 32-30 Akron. Oh 37-32, Akron up five. Barnett jumps a pass to Robinson, head of the arc. He's left open. He'll put up a three, and Titus hits it. Not always a part of his game. Robinson 0 for 1. From three this year, before that, he made one three-pointer a year ago. Fight for the rebound, and Mulkey comes in there and wrestles it away from UB. Mulkey down the floor, pitches it left wing at Barnett, top of the circle, McCray. High-low pass to Alston, working on McKnight. He puts it up and in with the left hand. It's 49 to 43. McKnight now 11 for 20 this year from three-point range. Left corner, Mulkey around his screen, shoots a three and answers. Byron's fourth three of the game. And it's Byron's got that shooting touch back. He's rediscovered it, which is a big help. Gray right wing near the right corner now for Mulkey. Byron comes back out top for Alston, swings at Oldham on the left. He'll put up a three-pointer. Back iron, no good. McRae the rebound, spins with the hoop, puts it up, and it's in and out, but Barnett all alone for the rebound following score. Mulkey between the circles on the dribble, right of the circle for Watt. Whips it to Watson in the right corner. Uh, Tony dribbles to the top of the key. Now Robinson feeds it to Mulkey. Left corner, he'll try a three and hit another one. Wow, Byron Mulkey with a career high five three. Byron back tonight from the outside. They need it. They need every one of these. Timeout, Akron. 
With nine minutes to play, Keith Dambrot calls timeout. Top of the circle, Robinson. Right wing, Zach Filzen. Zach with only three points. Foul line, Watt. Flips it to Watson, left of the lane. He'll hand it off to Mulkey on the wing. Right of the circle, Robinson. Now right wing, Filzen. Three in the air. Let's go! There we go. Zach's got to get... Got to get hot like Byron Monkey. The Bulls will be all right. Two-point game with 7.48 to go. Abreu, a pass on the left side, knocked away by Watt. It's loose, and Robinson grabs the ball. He bounces to Monkey, leaves it for Watt for the two-hand slam. Nice score, 6.10 to go. Great transition on the turnover. 64-61. Akron back on top by three. They've hit nine of 14 trifectas. Robinson to the basket, lays it up and in, and draws a foul. Titus Robinson uh, come alive. has come alive in the second half. I haven't seen him this aggressive around going to the basket. Five minutes to go, Akron up one. Left baseline, McKnight guarded from behind by McRae. He backs in on Javon, takes it into the center of the lane, and Javon steals it from him. <laughs> He blocked that shot without leaving the floor. <laughs> Mulkey up the left sideline. Mulkey throws it to Watt, has good position underneath. He lays it up and yeah. in. And the Bulls are in front. The front line's coming alive now without Marshall in the game. 65-64 Bulls, their first lead. One point edge for the Zips. Mulkey calls the set as he crosses half court. Watson left wing. Foul line McCray. Devon, nice. backdoor bounce pass, fills and pull up jumper on the right baseline. Good. And you'd be ahead, 67-66. Bulky from the left corner, bounces to Watt, left of the lane. Shot clock down to 10. Mitchell dribbles to the right elbow. Comes back out top to Mulkey. Only five seconds to shoot. Byron crosses over on McNeese. Goes left corner, Barnett. Dave shoots a three. It's in and out of back. 71-69, Bulls. What a shot by Barnett. Abreu back into the front court 22 seconds ago. Bounces to McNeese right wing. Hold him on him. Screen and roll to McKnight. Throws a dangerous pass cross court to McClanahan, McClanahan left wing. Back out high and over. Steals the pass. Garad goes in for the layup. Hooks it up and off, but he draws a foul with 10 seconds to go. Two free throws for Oldham, and the Bulls are only up one. So even if he gets them both, Akron can still tie. They have time. Free throw good. First point today for Oldham, who is three for three in his career at the line. Zeke Marshall has come back in for Akron, the seven-footer. The Bulls do not have any of their players on the lane line right now as Oldham shoots the free throw and switches that. 73-70, Buffalo. Robinson will harass McKnight on the inbound pass. McKnight, ready to heave it, throws a baseball pass down to McClanahan, catches right corner, fadeaway three to tie. Oh, oh it hit the oh, rim oh, and oh. almost went in. Unbelievable. 73-70, Buffalo. McClanahan yeah. almost made an incredible play wow. to tie this game. That was a great win for the Bulls.